This is Tara from the Fast Mode Studios. You have joined us in our MWC 2022 interview series. Joining us today is Andre Gunberg, Chief Revenue Officer of Matrix, a global leader in 5G monetization for the communications industry. Matrix Digital Commerce Platform is a next generation rating and charging system for 4G OCS and 5G CHF CCS. Andre will be discussing the latest developments in this space along with the company's plans for MWC 2022. Over to Ishan Rawal, our editor and correspondent. Thanks, Tara. Hi, Andre. Happy to have you on today's session. Hi, Ishan. Nice to be here. Nice to meet you. Great. Well, first of all, congratulations to the Matrix team on the recently announced USD 50 million in growth funding. What does this mean for the company? Are we going to see some major expansion plans, new markets, new innovations and such? Yeah, no, thank you. I mean, it's a great, great uh, confidence boost for us in the company here, getting this uh, kind of investment from the from the investing community. We are going to continue and stay true to our strategies. And, and that is, of course, to, to focus on the product, um, you know, making sure that we are uh, continue to be the leader in the market as well as our investment into cloud native and and the readiness that we have in that domain that's really one of the differentiators we have and we are going to continue and stay true to that so this gives us an opportunity to continue to grow that uh, that focus and also you know to continue to to win uh, the minds of the tier one operators uh, globally excellent but i still with new players eyeing a piece of the 5g pie how does a monetization game plan change for incumbent players such as yourself? What can they do about this? Yeah, I mean, 5G is, is you know, it's a very exciting area. And, and it's not just, you know, uh, uh, new opportunities. It's like a, a brand new pie for us, you know. So what we're doing is, you know, we're seeing new entrants coming in here, new uh, actors who want to try and, and play and, and get into this, uh, in this area using the private network as an example to find new enterprise uh, business. And, and the incumbents, of course, have an opportunity here as well to, to move into more uh, verticals themselves. And we see them as a giving, that's giving them an opportunity to grow also. But of course, they have as a little bit of a disadvantage is of course that they have a lot of legacy system and they need to change their way of operating in the field here so that they can monetize in a much more modern and future proven uh, way compared to what the legacy telco way has been. So that's where we can help them. And that's where we come in with our solution that can help them on, on this journey. So very exciting time ahead here. Right. Um... So how do next generation charging solutions power operator services at web scale? And what are some of the innovations that we can expect to see? Yeah, I mean, we, we, are, the, we are the web scale uh, monetization platform, uh, you know, by, by default, you know, we are, that's always been our motto. We, we have been that, uh, that's been our mantra from the beginning. So, so we are already, you know, helping operators with this, what we mean by this is that they are the, the operators and the telcos themselves has been you know typically being very focused around selling their telco services and and doing them on megabytes and minutes and, and seconds and text messages whilst you know in the future we th there is no saying what they're going to be selling in the future and and, and how they're going to be selling it in much more of a web scale fashion meaning throughout uh, you know automation services spinning up and down new services over a period of time and and doing it maybe all through self service you need to have a, a very different mindset on how you are monetizing such services than than traditionally the telco services has been done and this is where we have kind of you know come with our dna and are really able to help them achieve these kinds of challenges and and we will look forward to expanding on this going forward with with many of the telcos we're discussing with. Right. So one of the things that you specialize in are cloud native architectures. So technology wise, how ready are current monetization platforms to embrace new deployments such as cloud architecture, cloud native architectures? That, that's a great question, Sean. And, and you know, it's, it's a hot topic all over where we go, right? Because what many of the operators really want to do is to leverage the the, uh, the hyperscalers out there to be able to move to the cloud and bring down 
both the infrastructure costs but as well as the operational costs. So we have, you know, unlike because we are a true cloud native ready platform, we are taking the uh, the uh, approach that this is not really something that we want to decide for the operator. We want to give them the flexibility. So we are. We are, uh, you know, uh, certified on all the hyperscalers as well as on-premise solution if that op specific operator chooses to go that way and they need something that's on-premise. So we have taken upon ourselves to be convergently supportive of the different platforms as well as leaving the, hand, uh, the decision in hand for the operator to be able to, to them select themselves. We should not point them in one direction or the other. And that's something that we really have heard a lot of support for in our strategy and that, that the operators like. They want to be having the choice to decide themselves and not be enforced on, the, on this uh, upon them from the vendor. Right, so you basically want to give them a menu of options. Now, in keeping with that perhaps, um, we look forward to learning more about what Matrix has to offer at MWC. So. What is on this? What is new on this menu card of your offerings that is lined up for this event, and who will be your target audience here? Yeah, I mean, Mobile World Congress has been a difficult one to plan for this year. I, I see a lot of people uh, joining uh, very late now, and, and and you know, it's it's been hard to understand who's going, not going. But but for us, we have we have decided to go. I'll I'll take a small uh, group with me, and we'll we'll go down there, and we'll spend time with our partners and our customers and prospects, and and talk and share about these things that we have discussed today, as well as maybe you might have discovered some of the last press releases we have uh, launched now with with Google Confidential Compute and with um, AWS Outpost certification. So we are we are gonna be focusing a lot on on how we can help the operators uh, you know, move to the cloud and how we are working with, with the hyperscalers to support them do that, not, but, but with a flexible model. So yeah, no, we are, we are looking forward to meeting up again face to face, that's for sure. Great, that sounds great. Well, thank you, Andre, for joining us and for sharing some great insights on convert charging and all the other array of things that made Thank you, Sean, it's a pleasure to be here. Great, so back to Tara at the Fast Mode Studios. Thank you, Ishan. Matrix recently announced its partnership with Tata Consultancy Services to integrate uh, its plug and play digital business platform for subscription device and data management with the cloud native converged charging capabilities of the Matrix digital commerce platform. The company is also partnering with Google Cloud to deploy its platform on Google Cloud's confidential computing VMs for public cloud-based IT infrastructure. To learn more, visit metrics at www.metrics.com. And for more updates and coverage on MWC 2022, don't forget to visit www.thefastmode.com. Thank you and see you again.